with a left ankle injury for Houston. Same starting five. And Quentin Grimes coming off a strong game. Pass underneath left side and Tyler Edwards underneath and Mike P. Very smooth. Watch him in practice yesterday. He knows knows how to get in a defensive stance as well. Red Raiders. Shot clock slips under 10. Terrence Shannon. Santos Silva trying to pass out of it. That ball batted around. And away with it comes Houston. Giroux. Three. Sasser. Got it. Kelvin Sampson with, with pro experience as an assistant coach in the league. He's got some NBA sets. Look at that. Wow. Sasser feeling it early. Gorm trying to back down, but Klong, it does so, puts it up with the right hand. The Georgetown transfer who scored a thousand points in two years in the Big East. PV from the baseline, got it. Session of the day so far for the Red Raiders. Spin move, nicely done. Down to five to shoot again. Giroux trying to create. From the right elbow, oh, got it off, didn't get it off in time. Just had. They weren't excited about playing the game itself, but trust me, both teams will come out of this game today a lot better for it. Has made four field goals, but they've turned it over seven times. Struggling from the free throw line as well, and as a result, they're down 11. Lead. And the Cougars. Mills again on Shannon. Grimes. Provided most of the scoring early for Houston. Grimes has picked that up with a drive in wow. a bucket again for Quinn wow. Grimes. Right into the arms. Texas Tyreek Tech. Smith. Yeah. Tyreek, yep. We got the red shirt fresh. Sasser on the drive. Pulls up, throws it up, hits the front rim, able to get it back, and Sasser scores. Offensive rebound. Tyreek Smith cleaning the glass that time for Texas Tech. Another one of those good-looking freshmen. Edwards with a three-point shot. It's also one of the things Chris Beard mentioned that he wanted to see McClellan improve on, be more efficient from the field. Offensive rebound. Santos Silva. And on their in-state rival offer, really impressive job by the Alabama coaching staff and players. Rolls around Texas Tech and Amari Burnett got caught up along the baseline and turns it over. Free throw line oh, jump up and in once again for Tremont Mark. Over 11 times. And Houston is 5 of 10 in three point shooting. So they've opened up this 33 18 lead with three and a half minutes left. And they got good shooting like that. Time for this uh, Red Raider team, first two games, 19 points a game. Five in the first half for him. He missed all three of his three. The Cougars. You'd be surprised, Mark, how easy it, it, it or how, I should say how hard it is to Sasser's now nice picks pass. up the cousin, but they forgot about PB. And he's been the top scorer today. Santos Silva guarding Grimes. Finds a wide open Giroux. View it. So the foul won against Edwards. Coops maintain possession on the drive, high off the glass, around it, out, offensive rebound, though, back for Grimes. Agbo's in the game. And guys that click on a given night. Eighteen footer, Giroux. Well. A oh, good challenge by Santos Silva. They've got to cut into this deficit. Santos Silva, the lefty, and one. Comeback. But so far, Houston has not really allowed the Red Raiders to carve into that lead. Oh, that's right. once. And defense is about multiple efforts. Little zone now off the inbounds. Excuse me, Houston went zone there. Yep. Tech was good in the zone offense. Plays. By Gresham, gives it up. Sasser from the corner. 8 Eastern, 5 Pacific on ESPN Deportes and the app.
Russell Wilson just turned 32, and uh, that offensive line's got to protect. It's been a while since Tech has gotten it down to single digits. It was an 18 to 9 lead, and here you go. Kyler Edwards misses both, and it stays an 11 point lead for Houston, but taken away at midcourt. Shannon. That defense is, ra is ratcheting up. Look at Make it four. Just about two and a half minutes to go. Switched in by Edwards, timeout, 10. That kind of turnover to 12-point lead might not hurt you, but you do that at SMU in a one-point game, and it could change your season around. Oh my God. And a chance for a three-point play. Fran, Houston never trailed in this game, and just when you thought Tech may break through and make this a game, Houston did what they had to do, made their free throws at the end, and they go away with the win. They got the first punch in. They did. In a, in a street fight, you have to get the first punch in, and there you see the two coaches embracing. They'll, they'll wish each other well, and they'll root for each other during the season, Mark Neely.